Same page with Jacob Stallings, and now we are ready for baseball on a Sunday. 98 inside. He's been the DH all three days. May get back. So he's been DHing this three game set. And sends one out to left field. De La Cruz is back, and it dies on the track. Left handed hitting first baseman for the Braves, Matt Olson. Takes a pitch inside. That's a fastball that Act has three doubles against the Marlins this year, but those are his only three hits. Three for 20. So they've done a new team, new uniform. Does. Big shoes to fill. Freddie Freeman. And this one popped up left side. Brian Anderson drifting over and makes the catch. So two up and two down. Quality starts in 19 games. the bullpen six innings three earned runs or less this one popped up see if there's room for stallings or aguilar and there is nine pitches austin riley marlins have a one to nothing lead darnock and a strikeout grounds one foul now quite a contrast to the 23 he threw in the first inning that last start. Those first couple innings where could have let a big number go up on the scoreboard and didn't. That's to Jazz, and here he has retired the first four. Where he is the arm angle, and that's where Sandy can misfire once in a while. He'll get that arm angle to change, not where he wants it. Ball and no strikes to Ozzy Albies. You've said it. We've talked about it. Yeah. He's been good. Let's not get it twisted he's been good but he's at other times last year he's three and two <laughs> yeah but he hasn't really been good yet <laughs> yeah but you know what though that's again that's a testament to how on a start to start basis two and two to Albies and he strikes him out got him to chase that one oh for eight a strikeout and a walk in the series thus far I like that same little bit get him thinking Ground ball up the middle, right near the bag. Jazz off balance, gets the out at first base. And so he takes over for Jazz at second base. Jazz officially out of the ball game if we get uh, a fish mark today. This one popped up. Off of first, Aguilar is there, and Sandy Alcantara has thrown a perfect game, ladies and gentlemen. Here's Adam Duvall. Takes one inside. So there you go. The bottom of the third inning. Strike to Duvall. One ball, one strike. But it is a little different at home. 97 from head of Duvall. A ball and two strikes. In the air. Right center field for Garcia. Mm -mm. Marcus Stroman, a competitor. Yeah, the uh, the for the foreseeable future, six to eight weeks, with an oblique issue. A lot of those pitchers, position players, what have you. Those core injuries. One ball and two strikes to Demerit, and a swing and a miss. Sandy looking great. He's retired. Nine in a row today to start, and 29 in a row going back to last year. This one by Acuna out to left, and it's off the wall. So that snaps the string for Sandy, but thankfully it stayed in the ballpark. Looks like it may have gotten the top part. Acuna really quickly got his hands, opened up his hit, hips quickly to get to that pitch. So now, batter's retired. Dontrell Willis had 31. At one point, start a new streak right here. Dunan makes the play over to first, and Olsen retired, but Acuna Jr. moves up to third. And there now the Marlins will bring Not anymore. In. No, no. That's, that's why I said old. <laughs> first or thereabouts. And a ground ball. Oh. Dunan looks the runner back. Really surprised. I was just about to say. He and Aguilar have been going back and forth all weekend long. There's a 
ball just in off the plate to Travis Darno. So now the infield can move back. On a hop to Dunan. Makes the play. All right, when we come back. And really just have a great time with all the fans that come here. And Ashley, what's some of the ways that you prepare to make sure you jazz? But uh, that's pretty much how we get together. We just communicate and we make sure that we know where our hits are, what games we're playing. When we were here during 2020 and there were no fans in the stands, it felt empty, it felt lonely. And there's a drive to left center. Hey, Sue, thanks. Oh, no. That's off his glove and rolls toward the wall. And Albies is going to get all the way to third. Base error to start this inning. Face Austin Riley. Ground ball foul. Like the on field producers, Shayla, Lauren, they're the people that you're seeing making sure all the presentations before the game. Beautiful <laughs> braces helps. Yeah, me too. Buddy. Me too. <laughs> Excellent stuff. Appreciate the hard work all season long uh, by not just my popped up off of first base his first time up. Backing up Aguilar, and it's going to drop in a perfect spot. Albies will score on a bloop single by Dansby Swanson, and we're tied in the fifth. 2018. Runner goes. Throw from Stallings is not in time. And on you, too. Swanson being one of them. Inside on Duvall, and they have been super sweet. And he hasn't played that many games. And pours in a strike. That's low. First walk for Sandy this afternoon. And the Braves have play. You have to deal with Acuna. Inside the demerit. Now the plate jumping around them. Swanson at second, Duvall at first. It'll be a 2 2. And Demerit just got a piece. Pitch number 55 on the day. Here it comes. And he went around. Or did he? The home plate umpire's double for Acuna Jr. today. Hey, he went right back in there. Tried to change up that time, but missed low. Take a right. This is a deserted parking lot. 1 1 to Acuna Jr. That is low. No scoring affair in a game the Marlins want to win. The two seamer or go away with a slider. Ground ball right side. Aguilar makes a diving play, but has nowhere to go. Second, Swanson at third. And here's Matt Olson. Ground ball. And it's going to be Gonzalez. All right, so Sandy gets the be a Memorial Day. Ozuna to right field. Avi Garcia closing in on it, but not going to get there. Ozuna stays put at first, though, as a laugh with the leadoff base hit. May for Travis Darno. Did he go? No, ball one. And a multi. A one one in on the hands. Yeah, it's an interesting catching tandem. Actually, I think William has more home runs than his brother, too. <laughs> he, he might. 2-2, <laughs> runner goes, and chopped outside of third again. It's one thing the Braves really... 2-2, Ozuna not going, and another bouncer foul. Home run. Runner goes. Low throw from Stallings is waiting for Ozuna. 
stealing. Sixth caught stealing for Jacob. As Darno continues to bat. 3-2, and he lost him. Now word from FPL, which is a higher number for him. I would think in, in our conversation we had with the uh, start out of Sandy. Albies pops this one up. Long run for Anderson, and he'll get there in foul territory to make the play. Two outs here is Austin Riley. Outside. Riley struck coverage, does have a couple of home runs. Those came in Atlanta when these two teams faced off. Oh, season. With the 320 in the World Series. A swing and a miss. Sandy's got another strikeout. His fifth of the day prior to the game today. So we thank you for your service, your sacrifice, and the family's sacrifice as well. Behind home plate, Armed Forces Day was yesterday, but Major League Baseball celebrating all weekend long around all the different ballparks. Yeah, we did some uh, heavy wind in the area. We were going to have the Golden Knights parachute in before first pitch. As Swanson is down on... Sandy's certainly no stranger to these types if you count this one so far. Issues with Anderson and Anderson's been great since that first outing. But it's just something I don't know why it works out that way. Gonzalez makes the play to get Duvall at first base two away in the seventh. Numerous times he's asked about it what uh, feels like every fifth day. How did you pitch with no Run support today. So listen, I think pitches the ball and no strikes on Travis Demerit, the number nine hitter in the Braves order. Swings and misses there. One ball, one strike. Here it comes. And it's bounced towards short. A good hop for Gonzalez. And Sandy is through six. Really helps, and it actually really helped him tonight. Outstanding job, and this is exactly what the Marlins needed. And guys, once again, very efficient as he starts the eighth year. The last couple of seasons, we've seen a couple of them that were no hits allowed in a seven inning game it's not considered a no hitter but rather a notable achievement when you go and you <laughs> retire 29 in a row i don't care if it's a carryover or not <laughs> that's an na if i've ever hey, seen throwing one nine in big spots for the marlins yeah. today they have more hits with runners in scored position today three for 12 than they had in the last three games two for 29 the good and uh, we'll hear from you guys after the ball game we'll hear from donnie want to get an update on jazz as well who left the game with a hamstring injury but uh here's now matt olson And I mentioned it of Lone Depot Park. The, the Braves have owned them here. Braves have won. Abe does. He will set the tone. And as he is doing now, he works with a really good pace when he's in a good rhythm. Creeping up on 100 pitches for Sandy. The last year, he went six from that four times this year. This one down the left field line. Yeah, I looked up the same thing proud of and they'll say innings pitched Olsen fly ball shallow right Dunand was back on the shift and he'll make the catch for up. Marcelo Zuna with a first pitch strike no action in the Marlins bullpen just yet I know a couple of pitches I mean, he's he's throwing one ball and two strikes. Here it comes from Alcantara. Fly ball out to right field. Pretty well hit. Garcia is back, but he's got room. Eight innings of work for Sandy Al. Travis Darno to lead things off. Takes a strike. Still has 96 in the tank. Watching on from the dugout. Oh yeah. This one popped up. Foul territory. Aguilar makes it. And, and now this one into left. 
Grove comes from left field, but a little late. In error. His second of the year. And now Albies in the right field corner. Garcia cuts it off, fires in. Albies is safe with an RBI double. Then Albies. Now Riley smacks one foul. Not against the Marlins. It's easy to say that when you let him in a ball game. Well, that is certainly fair. And now this one is into the glove of Garcia. Tagging his Albies. He'll get to third. And that's the first out. All in the on-deck circle. Looks like William Contreras has gotten to the top step. So if it gets to Demerit's spot, it might be the guy who got his last time up. One of the seven for Sandy this afternoon. Change up that would be his fourth career complete game. Ground ball. Dunan behind the bag will make a low throw, but it's dug out by Aguilar. A run ball. 0 for 2 with a walk today. Takes strike one. Good pitch. 4 3. Two outs in the ninth. And Sandy is ahead. Nothing in two. And there might be a third in the National League. Popped up. Stallings makes the catch. It's a Marlins.